Hello Squeez, this is Squeezy here with another Java tutorial, and in this tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to do networking and more to networking URLs. Um, so I'm going to just going to show you how to pretty much access and parse URLs. So the first thing that we need to do is we need to type in, so I actually I have actually went ahead, created a class, and created the main method, and it's pretty easy. The first thing you need to do is create an object, URL, URL is equal to new URL and in the parentheses for the parameter you're just going to type in the URL so you, and you have to have the, pr the protocol it doesn't work without the protocol and I'm just going to put in my website for those who this okay this is mainly targeted for those who actually know Java and um, the web so you should know what a protocol is and you should know what an IP is um, I'm going to throw a declaration be or no uh, an exception because I don't want to. I don't want to take up all the space of having a an actual like try and catch. So now what we can do is we can do URL add add URL is equal to new URL, and we're gonna have URL URL slash Java dot HTML. So we can have this, and we can, and so what this does is it just adds to URL, but it, in, in, instead of going to AndyPhillips.org, it goes to AndyPhillips.org slash java.html, which is another part of the web page. And you, the reason why you'd want to do this is if you want to access different parts of a web page, but still stay in that same web page, if you know what I'm getting at. So add, add u URL to, we can have equals new URL and you can just have this again have another page C++ HTML. so now what we have is we have oh oh hold on this isn't right Slash. so now pretty much what this is is like this is pretty much just adding to this but you can use this if you want to parse just Java or just C++ so this would this would be helpful for other Helpful for helpful for other occasions. Now what we can do is we can do system dot out dot print line. And we can do port. The first the first thing we do is port, and we can do like add URL dot get port. And when we run this, what runs? My clip stopped responding. There we go. It gives us the port of negative one. So it doesn't have a port. That's what I'm gonna assume from that. And we can also do um you can do file. Add URL dot get gr get file. Can also run this. See slash java.html. So that's the file. Um, we can get the query query add URL dot get Query. What? Not one thousand percent sure why that happened. No, no query. Okay, and that's what I got last time. And so yeah, you, the the list goes on. Like, you know, uh, you can do URL dot. You have tons of stuff. You know, you can get hose. You can get the path. You can get the protocol. Okay, the protocol is pretty much just. Well, the protocol HTTP. That's the protocol we're using. So the the list goes on and on and on and on and on. You you can add many types of things, and that's pretty much it. Um, networking is pretty basic starting off. Um, just dealing with URLs. In the next tutorial, I'm going to do socket programming, and that's a bit more complex. But uh, that's all for this tutorial. Um, thanks for watching. Uh, check out the channels of the other squids. That includes my gaming channel. Um, I...
I yeah, you can check that one out. Um, if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, please say so in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe, like the video, or dislike it, whatever you whatever you feel this video deserves. It was kind of a short tutorial, I'm sorry about that. But yeah, this is networking is a fairly um, well, this type of networking is simple. It gets harder. <laughs> Trust me, it gets much harder. So, uh, thanks for watching, and see you in the next tutorial. Au revoir.